I'm back. I didn't turn this guy on. <laughs> so I'm kind of confused why he's on. But I'm not gonna lie, I like his uh, spunk this early in the morning. Oh. Oh. Right. You know what? I've been putting this off long enough. Get the achievement for that? Or is this is this on the floor? Okay, do I have to like call it a day before my character spawns onto the floor? Um, I don't know what to do. Imagine if the cat could knock over blocks and then <laughs> imagine the cat like knocked one of these little posts over and then that yard bot went crazy and destroyed all your crops. That would be the epic troll. So cringe. Well, actually, not really. I actually didn't cringe there. Okay, what do we need? Ooh, unlock new planet. Make a ton of money. We need 60. Um, actually, we're probably gonna make like triple this, aren't we? So we probably only need like 30 or uh, 20. Yeah, I'm gonna be a baller. I'm just gonna get 20. <laughs> I'm gonna be a baller. Okay. Um, You know, we could totally support fertilizing, um, oh, oh no, I'm literally an idiot. I'm pretty sure I did the exact same thing and I didn't fix the problem. You have to come up here now to get packages. this pansies we could start our hanging gardens now can I grab anything from down there from up here oh curses you know mm, mm. You know, for simplicity's sake we're, we're just gonna plant these over here We have 20, so we'll go 5 by 4 I guess. 
Actually, no, we'll do 10 by 2. Yeah, that's good. And then we're gonna get all these wheat. Oh no! I didn't want to. Crap. No. I need to. I need to switch these. My my muscle memory is already the other thing. Okay, that's much better. Okay, here's a pro tip. Never store your watering can or your mower. You're just gonna regret it. You should really get this in a more like sensible uh, kind of layout, right? This is a lot of overlap. Kind of makes me think like this design was maybe flawed from the beginning. Maybe I don't even need the this row here. Hmm. Well, this is all temporary, pretty much. So I'm not gonna dwell on it. Should I fertilize pansies? It's a lot of weeds. Oh hey, pumpkin harvest. Are these fully fertilized yet? No. They go down in quality? Oh man. Dang. They went down. They used to be brilliant. and I forgot I'm going to run out of fertilizer and then I harvest it before. So yeah, I guess it doesn't matter. I can still fertilize it. I don't know why I thought that was a problem. <laughs> oh, I forgot we're going to get money from this. And also, I just... I just looked up at my garden coins and I saw 42,000 and I was like, why are we still at 42,000 after harvesting all these pumpkins? And then I was like, oh yeah, that's because I'm fertilizing. I'm so dumb. Oh, you know what? We leveled up. I don't know what I'm getting, but whatever it is, it's going to help me get more money for this. I think I'll go trader, you know. It's already at 10, I just want to get it out of the way. Everything else will go into agriculture list, I guess. Oh yeah. Time to uh, harvest. I'm just going to do this. Is there anything in this? Yes. Yes there is, unfortunately. It's not too bad. It's not too far. Okay. You know, we're actually kind of running out of like mowing bags. Right? We already used all the mow bags from. What was it? You know, I don't even know why I'm worried. It's like I don't need money. I'm so rich. Dang, these used to sell for 450 with the price on down because then people for fertilizing. Dang, maybe you do need compost master. I wonder if there's like ever gonna be like a super secret item that's like you need a billion coins or something, and you just have to have like a huge fertilized pansy farm or something. It'd be cool if they added like some system for fertilizing automatically. Maybe there could be like a 
poop sprinkler. Oh, dang, I need one more fertilizer or they're going to be uneven. It's really going to make me go all the way back to the shed. This thing scares me. I feel like it's going to get loose. Like if I knock over one of those posts with furniture or something. I should probably store it in my tool shed. Or someone I missed. I guess I might as well hit these up too while I'm at it. 21 days! Oh my god. Well, I'm glad I only planted 20 of them, so I only have to fertilize 20 times, this times 21. How much is that? 420? I have to fertilize 420 times? Okay. Let's put this up. I kind of love it, just as like... Give some life to my yard, you know. Ooh. It's so cute, it's like the chibi version. Wait a second, can I put my cat in there? Nope, can't store your cat. Mm. I still be very vigilant, I'm gonna need the fertilizer. I need 420, apparently. I do like how the ratio is working out. I'm kind of managing to kind of break even mostly or closely on these. Like, two bins for this size garden seems to work very well. That scared me. I thought I just... There were two right there, so when I picked it up and saw that one was still there, I was like... My brain was like, dude, you picked up the flower. Actually, that's not what happened. Are we Gucci? I'm not seeing any more weeds. So, Tulip is the last thing we're going to unlock in the whole game. That's interesting. It's kind of expected though, because you have to wait 13 days for Cosmos, I guess. And like, I don't get why, because... Wait a second, is this low-key better? Well, there, there will be more harvesting involved, for sure. This is not quite three times as long as this. So actually, this was probably better, just because you have to harvest less often. And that's assuming you even need money, though. At this point in the game, you probably don't. I still need to hit a bird. You know? Maybe today's the day I'm gonna hit a dang bird. If will get out of the sun, coward. He was using the sun to hide. I think we gotta get on the roof. Oh, whoa, whoa, here's our chance. Oh, I'm so bad. Die, bird. Oh, I did it! I did it! Pour one out for our garden shed. Oh, hey, we got our compost bin back. <gasps> what? What just happened? It just fell under the world. Well, whatever. 
What was I doing? Uh, waiting for Cosmos? I guess I'm actually building now. I need to store some things. That would be a huge help to me right now. Just store everything. You know what? Stuff like this, store it two at a time. Don't be, don't be an idiot. Plus then you can pick where you deposit it. Oh hey. I guess I'm done with this. Free money. A lot of money too. Okay. I'm gonna try to put all the gnomes in my inventory that I can. I think that's literally all I can. Oh, this guy too, I bet. I knew he'd be one of them. There are not that many huge gnomes. I could probably use gnomes as like gargoyles for my hanging garden. I mean, I don't think gardens usually have gargoyles, but... I mean, I mean like... Or like a cupid statue or whatever you want to call it. No space, huh? That must be a rare gnome. Well, it feels good to clean these up. Wow. I find it funny that we just have eight of this guy. <laughs> I think he feels like not very special. Yeah, and I have like a complex about it. Can we just talk about how much better it's looking in here? I'm not sure if the if that's like glitching out or not. It looked kinda glitchy. Honestly. I think before we s Oh. Anyway, what is this Herbert? <laughs> okay. Before we start building our garden out here, I think we should probably w wait for the cosmos. And by wait, I mean just sleep for a bunch of days. <laughs> hmm, I guess I should fertilize every day though. So... I'm gonna keep picking a few things up though. by each other. Oh, right. I still haven't sold all these. Watch me actually need these for the top portion. You know? Because, like, these ones are too bulky or something. That would be funny. But they're super cheap, so I wouldn't really even care. I don't know why I have this over here. I'm stupid. I'm gonna put this, uh, I guess right here. I don't know. I need a mow again. Honestly, I feel like it, the best system would be to have a big portion of the yard. Put, like, all your composters there. And then you can mow this part, move the composters, then mow under them. You know what I mean? But that would be a huge pain as well in its own way.
What is this? Handy. Okay. So for now, the system I have to use is, uh, just kind of mow out, like, an area and move your composters there. Pray to the goddess of the garden that they don't just fly into the earth. Just like that last one. This is so... Uh, I haven't been able to mow very well on this side of the yard for a while. It feels like they had all those little potted plants. Pots there, and I had that garden there too. A bunch of compost bins and stuff. Look at all this grass in our yard. There's actually so much. Yeah, but. I, I, I want to reiterate how bad mower is. Like the mower skill. Even though I've never really maxed it to level 10, so I don't really know, but think about it. Would you rather have more fertilizer, or would you rather have the fertilizer do more for you? You know? Because if you have more fertilizer, that's more manual labor. That's what we're trying to avoid here. Okay, uh, let me get by the fence too. Try not to shoot the trash bag outside the yard like I always do. Oh, nice, got another one. I'll leave that there for now. Should I pick up this thing? What is this? Pick up on three days. I think we're gonna just put you on the roof for now, maybe. Or, uh, I don't know. What if we just set you down right here? That looks pretty cool. Not cool. I mean, it looks nice, that's what I would say. I should have thought about that more <laughs> before speaking. Um, yeah, I still don't really have a solid plan for this. Because... Because I don't know. Like, let's try something. Will this just settle between them? Or will it, like... I want to fall. I think the window is maybe getting in the way. Yeah, I think the window frame was getting in the way. Look at that. This works so well, I kind of just want to use this, just because it works well. Look, we can make a walkway. Honestly, here's an idea. Okay, this is great. We could, uh... We can do this for the walkway, because it works so well. And then... We can, uh, we can just build another one around the outside, I guess. Or we, don't, we might not need to go on the back portion, maybe we'll just build it on the sides, like... A, a, we'll just duplicate this again, and then we can build our garden on that. Right? That would be sick. We can do it on this side. In fact, that part can go all the way to the front, 
and we can continue our hanging gardens in the front. And then we'll have this little entrance in the middle. Oh my god. This is going to be so sick. This is going to be sick. Oh. We're cool. We're cool. <laughs> oh. Okay, I know what I'm doing now. I just need to do. That's always the hardest part. It's gonna look good once we get everything done and put benches everywhere and stuff. And the, and the greatest part about it is there'll be posts everywhere, but we will have nice like grassy area down here for like benches and, and paths and things. Maybe some flowers here and there. We can have our automatic lawn friend, lawn bot friends keeping us company, which is important. Important to keep company when you're uh, all alone. Like we are here. Well, we do have our cat, actually. Oh, I missed a spot on the grass. It's because all this crap. Dude, this stuff has been in the way for so long. I'm so good. The yard's looking better, though. It was looking like. It was looking really bad for a while. Oh, look at my little bench. Oh, I love it. This, whenever I see that, I think it's a well. I never did decide if we're gonna use this for anything. I, yeah, did I ever uh, actually like experiment with putting, if we can grow on that? Now if we order packages, it's probably going to ruin our stuff. I wonder if you can like set an order of operations for like which one they throw it to. Oh, that is, that is totally going to work. Look at that. Um, I don't know where a modern grill kind of fits in with hanging gardens. Honestly, I kind of like it right here though, because you got this nice stream making babbling brook sounds. We're probably gonna. Maybe I could build like a. Hmm. I like the idea of uh, the hanging garden going over here, but like right here we have a little like barbecue kitchen deck next to the babbling brook. We're probably gonna cover all this nastiness with tall hedges in the end, too. Man, I love how much freedom there is with the vertical building. <laughs> this is gonna be sick. My dog is making a very alarming sound. I hope she's not going to throw up. She didn't get off the bed, so I assume she's not going to throw up. She's never thrown up in the bed before, at any rate. It's because she's the best dog in the whole world. No cat. As the kids say. Oh man. It's so, it's so satisfying when you uh, mow right up against the house. I'm just gonna store you over here for now. Come out of the way. Me too. Wait, is this the sound we were hearing? No, no, it's not. We're definitely gonna have a lot of fountains up top too. Mm -hmm. We're probably gonna put gnomes on the top of them too. So we'll be ready for that. I kind of don't want to get rid of this. It's like it's a piece of history.
Do we just keep this to preserve history? What is that sound? That was so weird. I was like walking in place. <laughs> that was weird. Oh, you can stand on the grill. That's good intel. Dude, what? I slide off of this? I guess you have to be really centered, huh? I kinda wanna keep that. I guess I should keep this here too. Although, I highly doubt that's gonna work. Because we're gonna have big giant pillars everywhere. I think the side garden... I mean, it's not going to be like the one back there that goes all the way to the back. I think I'm going to cut it short, like right around here. And then... Maybe, just maybe... I don't know if I'm crazy enough to try it, but... We could get some pillars in here and have a path that goes over this thing. So it would be like the hanging garden goes over the entrance. I like that. So pretty much right here is, and maybe like right here are where the pillars are going to stop. So we will have a little bit of a front yard with no overhang. I should probably test if sprinklers like that work or if they have to be on the same level. That could be a slight complication. I don't really know how they work with like raised beds either. I don't know if sprinklers even work with raised beds. Or maybe you can put a sprinkler in a raised bed? Let's try that. Can I make this jump? Oh, I didn't know you could do that. That's cool. This game. Okay, am I gonna get rid of my uh, my house, <laughs> my real house, not the fake one down there? Hmm. I think I have to. I kind of like the idea of making another. Well, I do. I was gonna do the fake roof over here. Now that I think of it. I could have like a center area and like I could do a second level of hanging gardens base around the center area. Ooh, this is gonna be epic. Maybe the hanging garden extends over the house to the front here. Jesus, I am so ambitious. It just never stops. Oh my god, did I just slide off the floor? That might be a problem. Houston, we have a problem. Maybe it's because I was sprinting. Maybe you can't sprint or you slide off. I don't know. But yeah, this seems so sturdy it makes me want to get ambitious. It's so cool too. What color should I paint it? Should I do everything the same color or maybe like the pillars could be maybe like the pillars could be like dark and then the the floors and stuff could be like white. Or it could all be white, that would I mean honestly I kinda liked it all white. I feel like I don't know, I don't know. There's so many possibilities. How long have we been on this one day of the game, by the way? Can I not paint this? I can't paint compost bins? Ooh. That's 
Interesting. Ooh. Ooh. Is this the original color? It's like gray. I wonder if I can paint this one. Is this gray? This seems green to me. Huh. I feel like this looks more garden-y than this. Because this looks like a regular dumpster to me. This looks like a dumpster on a construction site. Actually, this looks like a bucket for like a, um, like a bulldozer or something. Or, yeah, I don't know. Whatever vehicle has a bucket, <laughs> I don't know what they're called. I'll go green. I'm definitely gonna, I think, be getting rid of this one. I said I'm not gonna need to in the finished product. Or maybe I'll just store it. You know. Since it's uh be sad if it left us. Okay, we can kinda narrow things. Wait. Okay. First we should check these. It seems like all these wooden things have the same color scheme. So... Light blue is out. The house is white, which kind of makes me want to go with white. What is this? Do you see a difference? Let's try it in the, in the day. I see in the day, but kind of in the shade, huh? Let's find something here. here. That is awful. This has potential. I... I think this is a no. This... is this brown? Is this black? I think this is supposed to be black, maybe. I guess this is brown. This is kind of blue-ish. This kind of reminds me of like a tree fort for some reason. I guess I could try... Basically right now it's between like this, this, this. I don't know, I think white actually looks the best. Even though it's what we started with. Because, I mean, they're hanging gardens. Like, what color do hanging gardens make you think of? Or like any kind of like ancient Greek or Roman architecture. Or, uh, I don't even know where the hanging gardens are, but basically ancient architecture from around that area. Like where the ancient wonders of the world are. You think of a lot of like white marble pillars on like on like the Parthenon and stuff like that. Oh, I can finally get rid of this stupid task. Am I? 
No, I'm not fertilizing those. I am fertilizing the pansies and the pumpkins. So I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna end the episode just cause uh, I feel like it. You know, I feel like I'm ready. I got a lot done. I cleared the yard out. Um, I just did a lot of maintenance stuff. I got a lot of our plan. I got a lot of our plan settled so we can actually start doing stuff now. I just a little bit of proof of concept. I do kind of want to get to 100k real quick, if I can, for the achievement, just so we make sure we have it. Okay, pumpkins are done. Now, onward to... pansies. You're going to be so diligent with these pansies, I hope. I'll try not to forget. I Honestly, I may have forgotten yesterday. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Um, I might keep the, uh, the peppers just in case I get that stupid task again. I can just get rid of it immediately. Oh my god, why are they doing this to me? Screw my cat, man. Brilliant! Can I just tell them to, like... You know? You know what I want to say. But it's you two. You know, you can't be too, uh... Oh my god. YouTube is just so, like, it's all about the money, isn't it? By the way, I tested it, and I'm pretty sure if you just click quit game, I'm pretty sure it starts a new day. Or like a hundred percent sure, I guess. So you kind of just want to quit the day at the end of the day instead of going and calling it a day and then quitting, like I was doing. That can result in some unfortunate things. Uh, I guess I should get a screenshot. This is my last one. Can't use that again. Maybe I'll take a screenshot of this. No. I thought maybe we could change the chimney. Maybe we can make a floor that's a different color up here though. Just to give us some variety. I'm thinking either like blue, red, yellow. Honestly any of these would probably work. But yeah, for now. Look we'll have our pit we'll have our paint brush up. So it's like we're doing that thing that artists do. Where they put their paintbrush up and they like put their thumb up with their other hand and they put their tongue out and they're like, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Maybe you might know what I'm talking about. Ooh. Ooh. I like this. I wish there was maybe some other colors like maybe red brick. Plus, I think whatever color this is looks really bad. So this is to me. This is basically just two colors. This is not an option. So yeah, they could use some like maybe red or yellow, like sandstone kind of, maybe. But yeah, it's fine because we're going with white anyway. This needs to be rotated, I think, a little bit. This one. I mean, maybe it literally doesn't, but we 
should be diligent. Oh no. What did that change? It changed everything. Yes, we're trying to get like... Oh, this is hard. We want it to be like... Even on both sides. So we should probably line it up like this. That honestly looks pretty good. So... We've got basically like one thing's worth of space between them. It's a good reference point. So we, we want to start at about here. Good, but it needs to be rotated just a smidge this way. Yeah, I think that's good. Anyway, I'm wasting time now. What was I doing anyway? Pick up home 20 days. Can I pet you? Will you stop tattling on me? You piece of crap. What's going on here? 100%. Okay, I guess this is uh, the end of the episode now. So, thanks for watching if you watched, and hopefully we'll build something really cool next time.